Right guys, so what we're going to do today is a really quick fitness video. I'm going to give you a quick update on what my physique looks like at the minute and how I'm feeling. So, basically, I followed Chris and Guzman's Summer Shredding Challenge. Um, he gave everyone a set date and the start date was the 6th of March until the 3rd of June. Everyone had to try and achieve the best physique they possibly could within that time limit, including himself. He made daily videos and he tried to keep everyone motivated. So, for the first six weeks, I didn't do very well at all. I actually had an injury, a shoulder injury, and I wasn't allowed to train or even do cardio for six to eight weeks, because I just had to rest my spine. Um, my start weight on the 6th of March was 85 kilograms, which isn't that bad for me. Um, I usually sit around 90 kilograms, but as you can see by my face, I'm not too happy with it, and I was very bloated, carrying a lot of water weight, and just didn't feel or look the best. I managed to lose 10 pounds, so I managed my final weight, which was in Portugal, was 177 pounds, and I weighed about 80.5 kilograms, so I lost a total of 4.5 kilograms, and I also lost 10 pounds, so not both, but 4.5 kilograms is around 10 pounds. Um, now, in the Portugal video, you can see it is very dark. This wasn't the best lighting, but you can see my abs are quite tight, I do have a few veins running through, I'm looking quite vascular, and I think my proportions are pretty good. So I was really, really happy with the way I looked on the 3rd of June. However, I will say, this picture here, which was taken on the 15th of May, that was probably when I was feeling the best. That was two weeks before Portugal, when my calories had been cut right down, and honestly, I think I looked the best there, and I also felt the best there. So I was around about 81, 81.5 kilograms when that photo was taken. Portugal, sadly, I had two or three days into Portugal. This video was taken and I had been off the diet. I had had beers, I had had lots of greasy chips, crisps, sandwiches, all the bad stuff, lots of carbs, and I had been drinking. So sadly, that isn't my best physique, but I am happy with the way I look there. Um, and watching back over it, I definitely think that is a physique that people can achieve. I think the physique that I have there is definitely sustainable. There's no reason why you can't look like that year round. And the diet plan that I was on really wasn't very hard. I was training twice a day. I was doing cardio in the morning and I was doing weights at night. And all it requires is a little bit of self-discipline. I was still having nights out. I was still going out for dinner every now and then. And I managed to get that physique. In that video, that's the best I've looked for the last five years. Um, I'm the same way I was five years ago. That was when I first started the gym. Um, so obviously I've got a bit more muscle now and I've just leaned down and cut off a lot of fat that I didn't need to carry. So in a really good place right now, really happy. I have been off the diet for the last two weeks since Portugal. Um, so I'm not gonna get back on on Monday. I thought I'd do a quick physique update. I'll also drop in a few pictures now. Um, this is what I look like in Portugal. If you need any help trying to achieve this physique, I can definitely help you. Um, nutrition questions, weights, cardio, what did I do? Please comment down below, I'm willing to help. Thank you very much for watching, and I would also just like to give a huge shout out to Christian Guzman for motivating me every single day in order to achieve that physique. He was making daily videos and showing us his diet, showing us his training, and motivating so many thousands of people, hundreds of thousands of people every single day. So well done to everyone that did the Summer Shredder competition alongside me, alongside Christian, and thank you very much for watching. See you very soon in the next video.